Hey guys, so today I have a small video for you today. I ordered a few things from Makeup Geek recently, not a lot, just a couple. I wanted to um, get a few more of her eyeshadows. She's expanded a lot since the last time I placed an order, and I haven't placed an order with her for at least a couple years. So I wanted to try a few, um, like kind of like one of each from each of her like new shadow line. Um, some of the colors I wanted were in stock, so I just had to get the ones that were in stock. I ended up getting just four, because uh, I didn't want to order a lot in case I didn't like them. I'm, I was pretty happy with the shadows I ordered from her the last time, so I was pretty confident I liked these ones, but again, I'm just playing on the caution side. So I've got four shadows that, are sh that I will share with you today. Um, the first one is the color Fantasy. It's one of her shadows from her foil blind. It's this nice mint green here. I feel like the mint green is great for um, summertime and spring coming up. I'm in love with the, the with the color um, mint green. And I'll swatch that for the back of my hand here. That's what it looks like. It's got a great sheen to it. Really like. I haven't worn it yet, but it looks like it's going to be awesome. The next shade. Let me just wipe my finger off here. The next shade is a matte shade. i kind of been wanting to get into the more matte eyeshadows lately. I don't have a lot of them. I have a lot of shimmery and sheen colors because that's what I tend to gravitate towards. Um, so I got this color. It's uh, called Dragonfly and it's from the regular, regular eyeshadow line. That's what it looks like there. And swatched on the back of my hand next to Fantasy. Um, they're great. They're extremely pigmented. They're really soft and creamy. They don't go blotchy at all like some mattes do. I'm actually really impressed with this matte color. Um, I use it in the tutorial here for the side makeup here look. The next shadow that I picked up is, uh, I think it's from the Duo, Duo Chrome line. One sec. The next shadow that I got is from their Duo Chrome line, I believe. It's this purple one here called Black Light. I kind of wanted to expand my purple collection, so I picked this one up. Uh, it's got like a purpley, but I can't even describe this color. It's just so unique to anything I have in my collection. It's got like a purpley, bluish, greenish, like, tint to it. I'm pretty sure it's from the Duo Chrome line. I'm not, I have to check for you. But that's the color there, right here. It's probably coming off a little different on camera than it is in real life. But it's I wore it the other day, and it's a great like it really helps um, brown eyes to pop, and would look really it would look awesome on any eye color really. And the last one is this one here called Fuji. I was eyeing it for a very long time, and I decided to finally take the plunge and get it. It's like a light, a bright yellow green. Again, it's really pigmented and very soft. I'm not sure about this color. I'm actually, I haven't worn it yet. I'm not too sure what kind of eye look I want to do with it, but that's it there, there. You can see my veins. <laughs> it's coming off extremely yellow on camera. Um, it doesn't have a lot of yellow in it. There's a slight shimmer inside the actual pan. On the skin you can see it just a little bit, but I think when you apply it to the eye, it will come up more matte. But yeah, those are the four colors there that I picked up. So far I'm I'm liking the way they swatch and liking the way they, they feel. Um, I've only worn the one black light so far and so far I like it. It did not crease on me, wore all day. I, I always put a base under my eyeshadows anyways, um, but they go on extremely pigmented, extremely creamy, like so far they're not blotchy. I'll give you an update more as I wear them and you'll see them probably in tutorials. But yeah, that was my small little uh, makeup geek haul. I want to get a couple of their sparklers and stuff like that. Um, I really do enjoy their their eyeshadows and I kind of want to branch out and see what their blushes are all about and she's adding like eyeliners. She's just expanding her line a lot. But yeah, so that's pretty much all I want to show you today was just a small little haul on what I got in case you see me. I just wanted to show them to you in case you guys were interested in, in Makeup Geek eyeshadows. Um, I haven't really had any that I haven't liked so far. But yeah, so that's all for today's video. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Hey guys, so I just have a tiny video for you today. Um, it's on... Blah, 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 blah.